bad liar. This is Mumbai on Demand with Annie. It's a Wednesday. We have to talk about food. Well, I do usually talk about food almost every single day, and which is why I have designed the hour and called it Grubble Issues Hour. But a Wednesday is uh, I pick, you know, to dedicate this to someone who lives by food. Literally, I mean, he's a food blogger and a very, very popular and sought after one we have in the city of Mumbai. He was just telling me a little while ago about how he spent two weeks in Sydney and he loved it so much. And for one, uh, I don't know reason uh, that he compared uh, Mumbai to Sydney and. And probably didn't want to really talk much about it. This is Kalyan Karmakar of Finally Chopped on the phone line with me. Hello, Kalyan. Hey, Ani. What's up? Literally, when you were talking about Sydney, you don't want to sit down and compare Sydney with Mumbai, right? Well, uh, I mean, uh, one thing which one loved about Sydney was like one could walk around so much, <laughs> yeah. and uh, the cafes, like you could sit on the road, and it's also clean, and uh, you know. Uh, it's, a, it's a very beautiful city, right? And uh, the other thing about Sydney is, I mean, uh, all the great food, and uh, especially if you're a meat lover, because since our options are restricted in India, right? So it's always uh, good over there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, even if he's not pointing out, we know the differences. So yeah, maybe comparison is not really a healthy thing to do right now. But food definitely is. Kalyan, what have you been doing the past week? Well, uh, Ramzan just started, and yes. uh, it's a great time to eat. Uh, in Mumbai, yes. And, uh, when when iftar breaks and everyone go out uh, to have their meal and stuff, Ramzan is one thing where I've seen which unites people across uh, Mumbai. So you know, people across communities and religions uh, go out to popular places like Mohammad Ali Road. My favorite place is this place called Bodi Mohalla, uh-huh. which is uh, close to Mohammad Ali Road. Okay, but uh, I feel has better quality uh, food over there. In fact, there's someone called Kuruj Dalal. Food first uh, introduced me to it. He's grown up in that uh, place. You get good stuff. You get uh, good kebabs, barhandis, and desserts and stuff. Nice. Like there's this uh, shop called Haji Tikka. Okay. Uh, which which is a kebab place, uh-huh. uh, and uh, you know, like people talk of baremi and stuff like that. But the food here is way way better. Like wow. the koftas and the kiris. And, and if you're not comfortable with red meat, I mean they've they've got very nice tandoori chicken and parathas freshly made and stuff like that. Definitely, the place I recommend to people to have uh, kebabs in Mumbai. Lovely. Uh, it's called Haji Tikka. Okay. And it's also called barbecue. So it's Haji Tikka barbecue at. Uh, oh. All right, we are still have to talk about the desserts that you have to indulge in at least once, if not. That you want to make it a habit this whole month of Ramzan. Don't go anywhere, Kalyan Karmakar. Or finally, chopped on the phone line with me. It is Foodie Chat on Mumbai on Demand with me, Annie.